when we used to fight, he used to be like, suck my <laughs> bitch. So I never used to suck his <laughs> And that's why he said he cheated on me. But you can't use it as an insult and then think that I'm going to do it to pleasure you. That doesn't make any sense, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> What's your? Let me get the wine. But I don't want nobody looking at my belly. <laughs> this is a uh, a show we're talking. My preference is black women. Okay, I, and preferably dark skin like me. Why? Can you get that door? Why? Hold on, he went to go get the door. Are you getting on here? Hi. Are you doing are you doing the show with me? We gotta get you a chair. We're talking about preference in men. Yeah, so yeah. My preference is black woman. You said why? Yeah. We gotta get you a chair. Can you get a chair? Get a chair. Because that's what I like. Why? Because I like I love my mother. That's it. My dad was my dad was a piece of shit too, so it's not like he could justify the uh a reasoning for me to want a black man. All right. so, but honestly right now I'm not being racist. Hold on. Um name a black man that you think is attractive. Um, pineapple cellar rose. A black man that I think is attractive. Come sit down. Okay. <laughs> Why well, I don't want to say it because it's kind of weird and everybody's gonna be like, Who is it? Um, little Uzi. What? <laughs> Somebody just said little Uzi was her favorite singer. <laughs> And the Wiz Khalifa, fine. Oh my gosh. Wiz Khalifa. Wiz Khalifa. That's my nigga. That's my nigga. Oh my gosh. That's tall, big lip. Goddamn. That's his nigga, fucking bro. UFC body. They were showing his toes the other day. It was a little crusty, but you know. Yes, I know it. We were talking about that the other day. How I talk about how I hate how when you meet a guy, they introduce you to their toes immediately. Too quick. Like, it's like boom, claws out. Put the fucking socks on, bro. I don't want to see those fucking... Slide over a little bit. Loki, I got to slide over. Like that? Yeah, yeah, I got He said that we were going to kiss on camera. You going to kiss me? We don't. I'm not going to show that. <laughs> <laughs> we don't sell sex. I'm not trying to cheat my way to the top. This is not cheating your way to the top. Yes, it is. We're, we're in a relationship. relationship. I know, but... It's this is my girlfriend. But yeah, but niggas want to see y'all kiss. They did. I guess I understand that. You That's could say, you you trying. could advertise this as your less, uh, first uh, female, female. What made y'all get into a relationship? And how long have y'all known each other? Let's get straight to that. Okay, so we... But you're not going to show us kissing. Are you going to show that? Nah, go ahead. If you okay. want to. I'll put tongue if you want. <laughs> <laughs> so we've known each other for how many know. years? We, I don't know, for a long time. Years. Probably yes. 15. Okay, what made y'all want to get into a relationship? Because niggas ain't shit. Besides... Because no, not even that. No, we this, have a... We have... This was the first girl that made me realize that I like women. She was my first girlfriend, first person that I ever did anything with. What year was that? <laughs> what year did y'all do that? Mm, what, 17? Were y'all drunk? No, before that. Mm -hmm. No. Y'all were sober and y'all did it? We were sober. Oh, y'all gay for real. Yeah. yeah. She was like, I feel like I like you. And I was like, I feel like I like you too. And she was like, you want to kiss? I was like, yeah. And that was it. <laughs> How masculine do you think you are? How masculine do I think I am? Mm -hmm. My extra that already. Not that masculine, honestly. No, no, no. no I'm really Be feminine. Between um, a scale between one and a hundred. Like a percentage. Probably like seventy percent. That's a lot. I you was think eighty. So? I said eighty. He said that that was a lot. If I, feel I like think you're that's more right. masculine than me though. Do you yeah. Do you think this is what I think a feminine woman is, like a hundred percent. Those women that um don't show their body, they don't show their face, and they don't talk back to their man. I don't want that, but I'm mm -hmm. saying that's a hundred percent feminine, no masculinity yeah. at all. That is not a hundred percent feminine. Um, what do you mean? How is that not? Are you kidding me? Not talking back to their man? 
That's you're talking about a um <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> he's fucking crazy. <laughs> no, he said the ones that don't show their bodies. Yeah, yeah, Let me ask you this that. question. Let me ask this, this, you this question. As a man, what is wrong with a woman that's comfortable in her body? Does that not, is that, that confidence to you? Like that does. You're becoming a danger to me. N- by what? What are you talking about? By the way you dress? Yeah, but like, why can't I dress the way I want to dress? Because and you're becoming a danger to me. Why? Because. When you go outside and you make yourself look like a piece of meat, niggas die and niggas want to fight over your body. Yeah, but you know who that? says who says I'm giving it to them? It doesn't matter, but niggas will start some problem. You know what I'm talking about? That's the guy's fault. I feel like it's not the woman's fault. A woman should be comfortable enough like to go outside. I don't even go to are. the club. I don't even yeah. go to the club. But as a man, too, you should be confident enough and to be like, know, that's, that my bitch, that's my girl. My girl she not about to step outside, outside of, stop, step outside of you. All right, but listen. She's not gonna do you dirty. Oh, my ex, man? my ex was very confident in okay. whatever I wanted Listen. to wear. Just certain outfits, like one or two things, he's like, "You're not going outside." Like so that. he'll let the yeah. be all the way out, and he'll be straight with that. Who's really walking I'm around with saying. their fucking out like yeah, that? Same. Like, I'm I can wear some shorts. Jeans. There's some jeans that just came out that's like that. They put the actual camel toe in there. I'm not wearing no, jeans that have no, purpose. No, the is out. I'm not wearing oh, no like jeans. they're like cut yeah. like that. Yeah. Uh-huh. And their out. Uh huh. They're real. Uh-huh. Like flex. You know that. Um, they have it like cut like this. You know that sheer. Like them cowboy you know pants they, shit. You know when the leggings are sheer and you can see the whole entire no, thing? No, send yeah, me the link. Know, I'll send it to you. When I find that shit. You know that shit ain't never gonna pop up again. <laughs> <laughs> that shit ain't never gonna show up again. <laughs> She's lying. Yeah. Cause they don't fucking shit like that. Uh, yeah. I don't understand why yes, men get is. insecure when women want to dress. The way that they want to dress. And even some other women too. They try to downgrade you and down, like downplay you as a woman that you don't. You're not, you're not confident. To do this. You're, you're not, not confident in yourself, this. or you're, you're not. not you're not this. modest, and you're. You're no one's gonna want to wife you if yeah. you're like that. You don't think that's true? No. Okay. There's plenty of sluts. Mm-hmm. All them porn stars that you like to watch all got husbands and men, no, 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 no. and they're literally. <laughs> you love porn stars. <laughs> you always talk about porn stars on Facebook. Oh, yeah. There's literally porn stars. They all are married. They all have husbands that come to those shoots okay, and watch you know, them get fucked. You, I'm walking around with coochie shorts right, and I don't deserve know, love. I'm a different type of savage. I be watching the porn stars interviews and they all get asked a question about how is relationships and they all say it's hard. It works out for a little while, but then the man gets insecure. And how are you going to not get insecure when another nigga's fucking your bitch every day? Straight up. Because she's still like, coming home to you. Yeah, but that's a different type of situation. And your bitch is out And she's the breadwinner. The problem is, is that these men meet meet, meet, meet these women in this and that lifestyle and think that they can change them. I was dating a guy when I was dancing, and he made me quit dancing. You want to know why? Because he met me at the club, He's literally on the like stage. And then... And then was coming in there every day to come watch my ass. And it was mad that when I was doing a lap dance one time, he was like, oh, you did all the same moves that you did on me on him. (laughs) You think that I learned these moves for you, baby? This is how you got hooked. These same goddamn moves right here. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Then I'm coming home. He's crying every goddamn night. I'm fucking counting money up. This man's crying in my ears. Telling me I got to quit. And then I quit. And then he's like, oh, you don't work no more. You're broke. You don't got no money. You made me quit my job. Right. Oh, he wasn't ready to take care of you? He did. He did take care of me. But he was, like, trying to complain about taking care of me. Oh, what's the point? What was the point, yeah. right? No Stupid, insecure-ass bitch. Yeah. And you know what? He used to call me fat all the time, and I was in very tip shape. He was white? Yeah. Yeah, because the way they look at physique is totally different. Yeah, like, I heard it. That was yeah, they, yeah. White girls that think they're fat and chubby, they do not be fat and chubby. Oh, they don't like that. That's why the yeah. difference. To, so I believe I have a fat ass. A lot of people don't. Some, my little cousin told me earlier today that I was shaped like my grandma. And I know that I am, but I've been working out every day. You, you see that weight right there? Yeah, you can always change it. Yeah, we're going to get cameras on that. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> I'll be in here deadlifting, fucking sumo squats. I'll be doing it all, okay?